If you guys ever had the chance to get in somewhere abandoned and see what it looks like on the inside, finally found a spot near me. So, if you're curious to see what the inside looks like, stick around and find out. It's like a wall that we just walked past. Guys, we've been scouting the area out. We found the wall where we can get in there, but we're also trying to make sure that we don't get into any sort of trouble by getting into here. So we're trying to kind of scout it out and see what the easiest timing is going to be for getting back in there. Because the last thing we want is to get any sort of trouble with local law enforcement or anything like that. I think once we get back in there, we're not going to have to have too much worries. It's just getting back in, in there that we have to worry about. Mm -hmm. Without any more us. So we're just to get close to there, and then once we get close, we're just going to walk slow and wait until there's like nobody. I feel like this is kind of creepy yet exciting at the same time. Alright guys, so the feeling that we kind of have going right now is one that's kind of tough to explain. It's like a little bit of an adrenaline rush, a little bit of excitement, but at the same time that feeling of wanting to be cautious and make sure we don't get hurt or into any serious trouble. So we're going to be kind of checking out everywhere around here, making sure no one's around that's going to hurt us. And if there are people around, try and get out of here without getting any sort of serious injury or anything like that. Guys, so one thing I do find kind of creepy about this place is with how close it is to the road and everything, it is oddly quiet down here. You can still hear some minor traffic, but it's not as loud as it is when it's outside.
The thing is kind of wondering where that mug is at, you know? Right. Mm -hmm. Is it right there? Yeah. 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 And if for some reason you guys are wondering why there's moments where I keep turning the light on and off with my cameras because there are little pits like around here where it's a little bit darker because we don't have the natural light coming in from the sun versus over on this other side here where there's a little more light coming in. It's crazy. There is one thing I've realized about this place though, mm -hmm. is there is absolutely no airflow down here whatsoever. Everything just kind of sits stagnant as far as airflow and everything, so it feels like it's a little bit warmer in here than outside. Guys, we're just walking around on the outside right now. Um, there is one painting that we thought would be interesting to see. We're gonna see if we can try and find it before we leave. Disappointed that we can't find that now. You know, I feel like we need it somewhere out here and walk right past it. Walk the thing.
Oh, you got a crown down. So guys, with all our exploring, we finally found where the piece of work that we were initially interested in was at, but it looks like someone has already covered it up. You can see some of the remains of it, but it's not in the condition it was that we were looking forward to. Well guys, that so seems like that initial caution and adrenaline rush that we've had is kind of dying off a little bit. It's there's some sort of uh, excitement that came across as adrenaline rush that I don't really know exactly how to explain. It's just that thought of doing something new and kind of getting out and exploring that kind of just built up that, that uh, excitement that built up that adrenaline rush. And just kind of seeing what was left here. If you don't know, this underground parking garage was actually getting built, I believe for a shopping center or something, and, thing, and uh, things didn't work out and it fell through. And eventually it started to just sit and started to fall apart and as you can see people have been getting in here and spray painting things on the walls and people come in and explore it and everything but at the same time i do have to say is if you try and do anything like this be respectful don't damage it or take anything that doesn't belong to you and be careful don't cause any unneeded injuries or troubles just to get in and see somewhere so guys that was a little bit of an exploration around an abandoned underground parking garage um, if you liked what you saw go ahead and leave a like on the video uh, share it with your friends and family and if you like seeing this and want to see more Go ahead and uh, leave a comment down on the video down below to let me know. But just remember, enjoy life. Take it a day at a time. And I'll catch you all next time.